Hello, and welcome back to the Interpac Academy. I'm Teresa Hippis from the Interpac Commercial Marketing Team. Welcome to our third and final video in this series, selecting the correct cordless or AC powered pumps. There are many industrial pump types available to you as you set up your system. Selecting the proper pump model can be a challenge. In this final video, we will look at how to select the correct cordless or AC powered pump for your system. One of the newest industrial pump types is a cordless or battery powered pump. As the name implies, these pumps offer high performance without the need for a cord or air hose. While early versions of cordless pumps came out around 30 years ago, they used small NICAD battery packs and were not powerful enough to operate in the pump market. Today's cordless pumps use modern lithium polymer battery packs, usually in the 24 to 28 volts DC range, and offer reliable and sustainable power for many applications. The latest offerings, such as the Interpac ZC3, provide much more performance and features a powerful 82 volts DC battery pack. Many of the same selection criteria discussed in the first two videos are the same for these powerful pumps. Smaller cordless pumps in the 24 to 28 volts DC range can run smaller tools as hand and small air powered pumps. These pumps work well for tools in the five to 25 ton or 45 to 232 kilonewton capacities. These small cordless pumps feature reservoirs sized to support these tools and are available in versions to operate single acting and double acting tools. With the release of the ZC3 cordless pump, the advantages of cordless pumps can be used on larger applications easily as high as 100 tons or 933 kilonewtons. With larger reservoir sizes, this larger cordless pump can support many larger intermittent to light maintenance applications. They offer the freedom of cordless with the added benefit of lower sound levels due to the brushless DC motor technology. AC powered electric pumps offer the most options and power ranges. Typical AC powered pumps can range in size from 0.5 horsepower to 18 horsepower or 0.37 to 13.3 kilowatt and from 0.5 to 25 gallon or 2 to 100 liter reservoir sizes. Depending on the selected size, these pumps can power small tools and cylinders to lifting systems with thousands of tons or kilonewtons of capacity. To select the correct pump for your needs, you must first determine a few things about your application. All the same selection criteria discussed previously in this series still hold true. You need to have a reservoir large enough to provide enough oil for your system. If your application will be in a production or high ambient temperature environment, you may need to go to an even larger reservoir to improve the cooling properties of your pump. If needed, a heat exchanger can also be available. Along with these requirements, you will also want to look at the application to determine if it is an intermittent or continuous use. For intermittent applications, the pump may need to be transported often, so weight and carrying handles will be important in the selection criteria. If it is a dedicated application, such as an in-plant production operation, mobility will be less of a requirement, but mounting options may be more important. Also, the electrical power available will play a major role in the pump selection. Most smaller AC power pumps are available in single phase models. As these pumps get larger, they may be available in both single phase and three phase versions. The largest pumps are only available in three phase models as single phase electrical circuits cannot provide enough power to operate these larger electric motors. The final consideration will be in the type of electric motor selected. Smaller pumps, 0.5 to 1.5 horsepower, 
or 0.37 to 1.25 kilowatt in size may be available in both universal or induction electric motor versions. Each of these motor types have their advantages and disadvantages and support different types of applications. Universal motors are only available in single phase versions, limiting their size to approximately 1.5 horsepower or 1.25 kilowatts. Universal motors typically see a reduction in RPM as the load increases. The pump flow performance with each of these motors may vary slightly. The universal electric motor found in the Interpac PU and ZU series pumps offers a very high power to weight ratio, small size, and the ability to operate with poor input power. These pumps also do not require the large inrush current draw when starting. They can be started and stopped many times. Universal motors operate at high RPM ranges, so they tend to have higher sound levels and may require a gear reduction for proper pump operation. These parameters make these motor pump combinations ideal for intermittent duty applications, usually outdoors. Ease of transport and operation on generators or poor power supplies are typical. Induction electric motors used in the Interpac PE and ZE series pumps tend to be larger and heavier than similar powered universal motors due to large amounts of copper used in their construction. These motors typically require good input power supplies and develop high inrush power requirements during startup. These parameters support these pumps being turned on and left on for extended periods of time, such as for production operations. Induction motors also run at lower sound levels and at a very constant speed, regardless of load. I hope you found this video on selecting the proper pump useful. This information should help in selecting an industrial hydraulic pump for your application. Over these three video series, we learned terminology and discussed features of the common pump types to help you understand and determine how various industrial pumps work and operate in your system. For further information, please visit us at interpac.com or reach out to your nearest Interpac contact for further assistance. I'm Teresa Hippis, and for the Interpac Academy, thank you for watching.